Hello there, my name is Mr. Smart Anki. Welcome back to my let's play of Shogun 2. I was gonna say Age of Empires because I recorded that earlier. Shogun 2, the Atori clan on legendary difficulty. So last time we left off, we were besieging this town, Echu, uh, the Oda, which we just attacked uh, last turn. And now all sh hell is breaking loose, literally. Anyway, so they got a bunch of katana cav, uh, seven of them. They've got six katana samurai, they've got two yadashigaru, two barshigaru, and of course samurai retainers. We of course have our standard army with one general. Um, so yeah, I think this is going to be a very fun battle. We are defending, so that's good. I'm glad they actually came out and attacked me because there's more units coming and there's also, uh, I think the next province over is Hida, I believe. This is actually not a very good place to defend, but it should be alright. I, if I can run over here, it'd be great, but I don't think I'll actually try that. We'll, we'll have a look when we get in there. But anyway, Hida, it, I saw they've got a, at least like a castle there as well, and a whole lot of units, so that's going to be another tough fight. So, uh, either way, I don't want those units to go out and take uh, Kaga and my other provinces, so I need to take care of this province and then move on right away and cut them off from being, being, being able to go anywhere. And once they're cut off, then it should be all good. But we're looking all right. I just need to get these key provinces, and then if anything happens, we can just defend. But we can't have um, we can't. Oh shit! Of course, we can just place our units anywhere. I've got ready Atori. Okay, now that's great. Oh man, I could put them up here. <laughs> yes, please, I will. Um, but yeah, if if anything, we can always defend. This just money is going to be an issue in that case. Oh my god, this hill is immense. Oh, and I can't actually come up from here either. That's amazing. That's good. Um, I'm gonna put these guys over here. Are they hidden? Yes, they are. I want them to stay hidden. I want the main force to be coming for uh, the katanas and these fellas. Actually, I'll put two of these right here. They're not hidden like that though. They are. And then we'll have these two over here. The only thing is they're only going to be able to see my general and this unit as well. That's better. Oh, they can't see this unit. Actually, that might be alright because then they're... No, I, I don't want him to be... If I, if I want to have anyone be seen, it would have to be this one. So I'm just going to have to... Do it a little bit more like that. Right, now they're all hidden. Um, and have you guys as flanking units as well. I think these guys are hidden anywhere. Oh man, this hill. <laughs> That'd be crazy. <laughs> um, yeah, they're, anyway, they can only see the general, so they're going to be focused on him. Uh, which means that I would have to place them over here and then have to run them over here as fast as possible. And I would have to actually know... Okay, so it looks like we can, yeah, we can climb here, just not here. This little patch of land, so we should be able to just run around this way. That's fine. I could actually just charge them right now. I think I'm going to. Use my Nagnatas as well. We got a, a downhill charge on the Katana Cav. I don't care if they're Cav. They will get absolutely bum fucked. And move these two forward as well to cut off the rest of them. And these guys stay behind because they're just a purely charging unit. We should be making relatively quick work of these guys, especially if I can get these guys in there as well. I'm gonna make sure I cut off these guys. Oh, hello. Never mind. I'll cut them off. Probably should brace for impact rather than charge them, but it's fine. Oh crap, really? Oh fuck. See, that's not good. That is one thing that we cannot deal with. We are as fast as Katana, so we should be able to get away from them. Fucking hell, if only I noticed that though. I need to run them over here. Down to 31 men. But my generals should be up front. Get in there. Okay, you guys get in the back of them. There's only 22 left there. Alright, there we go. Let's get them over there. 
Actually, no. Charge them in there. These guys are going to go all the way around. Be my special flanking force. Alright. I tried to brace a little bit. Just going to send them. Actually, just going to send them over there. You guys go around and charge those Yari Ashigaru. That should be a pretty good charge. Alright, General. Get over there. You guys stick on them. Okay, so only unit that's losing a lot is that one right there. I'm actually going to pull them out a little bit. Actually, no, I can't do that. You need to stay in there. You need to pull out. Okay, that unit, yeah, that got absolutely torn apart by the charge. And that's why I want those charge units. They lose a lot of men if they stay in for long combat, but the charge should be devastating. Okay, these guys are still chasing off that unit. Keep at it. One mistake I made so far was leaving the general out of... Uh, out of my own sight. Besides that, no real mistakes were made. This chart should do devastating effects to this units here as well. Or these units here. Look at those numbers dwindling my so lord, fast. A glorious victory will soon be yours. Alright. And that was this army's Um Perfect use. Well not perfect use. I mean this is the, the army's strength right here. Look at the numbers. Barely lost anything. This, this unit, which I used to cut off this uh, unit from trying to uh, flank me. And then it got also attacked by other units coming from behind. Uh, so that was the only reason why they lost a fair amount of men. But they also killed 200. Uh, Nodachi's 98, 86, 105, 83. But they had the effect of just breaking everything. Didn't lose our general, so I'm happy about that. 113, 84, 60, 32, 17, 62, 93, 149. There was only a few units of them that were actually in fighting for a while. Oh man, look at these guys, they're catching up. I love how fast the ninjas are. You can basically use them as like a light cavalry unit. You guys just back off. You're not gonna catch anyone. But yeah, that was a good fight. That was really, really good. I mean, there was no doubt I was gonna, no doubt who was gonna win that. But the results are definitely good. These, this the unit did really well as well. They only got 43 kills, but they're only fighting one unit that only has a max 80 men anyway. Uh, general, what are you doing? All right, you've killed a fair amount of these men. Looking at the bodies there, hundreds. I think I'm going to send you after these men, though, because there's a lot that got away over here. 160 Boshigaru. That's not actually a good target, but still 160 men, so it's an easy target. And the border is relatively far away, so we should be able to catch them, actually. How about one of you go after these men? Inspire yourself. I really don't think it does anything. I always just do it for fun, really. Okay. Killing this men, or this our, our units, relatively quickly. Down to 100 men already. There are some other units that run away and are all too small to really chase. I think we're just going to keep out this unit, even though there's a bunch of them that went this way. Which are about to leave the field. Alright, let's kill a few more of them and that, that should be it. I don't know where else the rest of those men are. Okay, that should be good, and then we should be able to actually auto-resolve the next fight. Let's hope they also attack my other army, but I really doubt they will. I think they're actually going to wait that one out. Which is alright. They do have five turns though, so it means I'm going to suffer some attrition. I just, I, I don't want to siege it. I know I'm going to lose a lot of men if I siege it. And that's the fight uh, against the Kitabatake, actually. Kitabatake. How fast can you say Kita Patake? Leave an audio file in the description. Anyway, uh, so we lost 460 men. Yeah, that's absolutely acceptable. Cool, that was a good good fight right there. I'm happy with that. Oh, that Shogunate. Fuck off, mate. I'm the Shogunate now. Well, I will be in four turns anyway. Ah, yes, they are fighting it. Awesome. That's really, 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 really good news. That is the best news I could have had. And this should be a fairly easy arm to take down. 
no katana or anything. Just more archers, but if, if we get another hill like the one just now. Oh my god, that's also a really good hill. Forest as well, so we got cover. They may be cheeky and just have uh, like have their archers shoot me, but even then, their archers are Boshi Gar without any experience, so... I, like, in the time that it, it will take me to get to them on our charge, it's just not gonna be enough for them to do any any real damage. And the rest is Yari Samurai and what else? Uh, 190 Nata Samurai and a bunch of Yari Ashikaru, it's no problem. I'm really, really happy they attacked me here, because that frees this army up to do other things, and I need this army freed up to do other things. Although I didn't actually think about how happy this province is going to be after I left it, so I may have to send a, uh, a monk over at some point. Anyway, um, so yeah, this is my half and half army, half good, half bad, although these guys are still useful. Oh, of course, I have archers, I completely forgot about that. So let's have a look at this. So they can climb up through here, they can climb up through here, they can climb up, well, anywhere behind really, but I doubt they will. So, all we need to do is fill up this gap, and this one possibly, with a Naginata unit, and this one with a Naginata unit. actually don't like placing these units like that too much, just because then one of them is going to be in front of the other one, then they all just start focusing one unit. But in this case, it's alright. And, oh shit, of course we don't have a Naginata. Oh, wait, we have, the, we have a better option even. <laughs> we have Yari Ashigaru. For defending gaps, I will take Yari Ashigaru over Naginatas. Yari wall. Watch them never be able to come through here. Well, I think I remember saying that at some point on a different campaign. It may have actually been this one, I don't remember. And that did not quite work out, but let's just not not remember that. Not, not think about that anymore. Okay, I, I like this, but it, it does mean that we're standing with our backs towards the enemy. We are hidden though, so they might not see it. So it should be fine. Um, we're going to have this unit defend this gap right here. That should be hidden like that as well. Nope. I want it to be hidden. There we go. That's hidden. And now we have one more, which I might just leave in reserve. Or I'll just place it right. Yeah, I'll just place it right here. We have katanas in reserve. That's fine. And let's have these guys stand over. There, and over there, and katanas, katana samurai ni kazaimas. Right, just have two lines. Okay. Oh right. Okay, that should do it. I'm gonna leave the general back here so that it's the only unit they can see. So they'll move all the way over to right here to start shooting, and then we'll be like, hello! Uh, including that sound as well. Okay, so that should be all good. It's gonna be a more traditional fight, which I guess is fine since we haven't really had many of those since we started building our late game armies. It's just pure rush in there, kill everything as fast as possible. Which I still could do with this army, actually, but I think a more traditional approach is better. Especially since we have the four Yari Shigaru, I should use the strength. Plus those units, if anything, are going to get replaced. If any unit's going to get replaced, it's going to be them. Um, so if they take some losses, it's fine. But I really doubt they're going to get replaced. At least not anytime soon. Alright, so they're nearly in range already. My archers were actually starting to fire. Which, we're gonna let them hide again. Alright, now I'm gonna start firing again. I'm gonna put these guys in the iron wall. I don't think that actually makes them visible. Our hidden units have been discovered, my lord. Put all of them in the iron wall. Oh no, they have fire arrows. I don't have those. I forgot. These guys have been discovered. Okay. Uh, Alright, so our archers are getting a bit fucked, but we're getting, or they're getting in there with their men now. I'm gonna take these two units and run them around here. And I'm gonna do the same thing over here. 
Not run them through there, though. And then these units, this one is going to be sent down there. This one is going to back up right there. Oh, right, hello. Kind of defeats the purpose of this unit, but it's fine. Uh, you are going to just charge down there as well. And you are going to come around this way. And you can just stay there. We don't need you. Right, you get down there as well. Two of you start running that way. Actually, yeah, the... I guess the ninjas... Can, actually, no, ninjas... Get over there and start throwing bombs. You two. Actually, that's really dangerous. Let's not have you throw bombs. The other guys can. Okay, charge into that Yara unit. Thank you. You guys, just, just go over there or whatever. I don't know. Do something. Okay, so the only unit that's really getting fucked is my archer unit, but uh, no one cares about them. Ah, who just threw bombs? Tell me who did it. Oh, it was them. I was said it was alright. Actually, yeah, it is alright. See, I placed them. It's, I did that on purpose, of course. I placed them so that they can't hit my own men. I did that completely on purpose. Right, you guys got out of Yari one. And get your ass in there. Okay, you push through. Just go into that unit. Actually, yeah, I may as well kill that unit first. Okay, do I have any more katanas that are left standing around? No, I don't think so. You guys got a Yari wall. Let's get in there. I need to kill this freaking unit, but he got extra morale because of a stupid general. Otherwise, we could just push through and shatter all of that over there. Alright, kill the general quickly. Okay, really? Um, you, stop throwing bombs. Actually, no, yeah, you're still doing alright. I forgot about that. Keep forgetting that he's alright to throw bombs. Eight man, come on, die already. There you go. Okay, here we go. You just charge on that. One unit charge on that unit. Badoom, badoom. Badoom, badoom. Badoom, badoom. Yeah, see, we got in the rear there and it instantly shattered. That's what I was going for. But the stupid general helped me up. There we go. Alright, good job, general. It's all on you. Need to kill as much as possible here. Because it'll make the autos off better and more efficient. Oh god, they've got a lot that gets away, but it should still be fine to auto resolve the battle. We have ninjas. Ninjas, where are you at? I forgot that you are over there. How did you not out of bombs yet? You only have two bombs anyway. Ooh, you should be able to kill some men. El General, where are you? Oh, he's over there already. Good. Okay. That is Boshigaru as well. We need to kill... Just, yeah, we just need to kill as much. There's not really any better best unit here. Obviously, it's better to kill... Yaris, or sorry, Samurai, but there's not too many left of them anyway. It's mostly bow units that are left right now. And we just need to kill anything because it's going to be an auto resolve anyway, so it doesn't matter what we kill, we just need to get them to have less men so that the auto resolve is more favorable. Okay, kill some of that. Ninja's done any killing of late? Probably got a few kills there. Meh. A few. Oh my, what the fuck kind of blob is that? They're not going to be able to reach that. Kill these men instead. Come on, who are you? How many kills? 35, that's not enough. Get your shit in gear, mate. No. That's too late now. Actually, no, we can possibly get that unit. How many have you got now? Alright, they killed like 40 men in that time. Not bad. They still have bombs as well. It's a bit risky, but come on, throw bombs. Hopefully before they reach the end, please just throw some bombs. Please. Please stop moving and throwing throw bombs. Do a little bit just throw a little bit bomb. Okay! Well done with the whole bomb throwing thing. You did exactly what I asked. Uh 25 yeah, alright, whatever. Decisive victory. Yes, I would say so. Well, that's an interesting start to this episode so far, and a fun start, because there haven't been too many fights in the last few episodes, I believe. But those two probably made up for it a little bit, especially the first one, that one was interesting. I love that, that hill, that was probably the best hill you could ever ask for, well, depending on the situation. 
a best hill to charge down from. I mean, you could say without the trees it would have been even better, yes, but if it had... Oh, uh, without the trees I also wouldn't have to t have any cover, but of course that didn't matter in the end because of the way they were set up. Anyway... Um... Yeah, Katana's up there, General up there. Pretty... Normal stuff. So yeah, we should be able to auto resolve that as well. Down to minus 3k per turn, it's already going broken. Surprised that they didn't actually join yet. The, uh, the war against me. That really doesn't care. I guess she is the only real thing I want to go for now. There's just nothing that's going to save me from money problems right now. His son is born. More mouse to feed. <laughs> um, yeah, this is the army that I've been talking about. So we're going to take this now. Thank you. I'll take that. Fix that up. Monastery. Oh, that's good. Plus one happiness for Buddhist populations. Oh, wow, 21. Fucking hell. Fucking hell, like... Oh, it's because the two monks are in there. Right, we can move on right away. Ooh, it's just... It's winter. We won't be able to... Oh, wait. No, we can. If we can finish. Or if we can do this. Nice. All right, so now we can take that town right away. Which I think we will. It means this army can then attack me the next turn, but that's fine. All right, let's go and take it. I don't think I've ever had I don't think I've ever had a town actually be happy after taking it <laughs> it's just because of the monks but still it's funny all right let's fix that oh my god why the fuck have we got a sword master school here are you kidding me it's crazy I'm so surprised by this icon I've never even seen that icon like why well, I've seen an icon before it's just I've never it's so uncommon Anyway, um... Oh, because we need... Oh, wow, we don't even have war horses, that's why. Because I was kind of, like, I knew the icon, I was like, why do I know this icon and why don't doesn't it ring a bell? But yeah, it's I knew it was war horses, I just didn't consider that we need to resource war horses. I don't think I've ever had that problem. I mean, it's not really a problem, but still. Um, I probably could even go out and attack them right away. And not lose too much. Fucking hell, are you kidding me right now? They don't have any- oh, they do have free archers, actually. If I run back, though, I'm not going to be sitting in a town. Uh, why is this so... Okay. Okay, they're not in the town. That's kind of problematic. Fucking hell, why did I- I just didn't think it was going to be that bad. Well, worst case scenario, they attack the town, I just... Actually, well, it's not bad. I actually get these six, seven units extra, and that might actually make the auto resolve possible. Um, which is funny. Um, so that technically wasn't necessarily a bad thing, it just wasn't a good thing either. Oh man, I thought we were able to move to here. That's what it said last time. Maybe it's because it's winter. I still don't know how that really affects anything, but it seems to do it somehow. That should level him up. Nice. Alright, that's the Kita Patake gone. And now we have an army available to, to uh, take Awari or at least defend from Awari. We're also down to two food, which is something we need to look out for because we're going to be taking provinces that are all like heavy on the, um, on the castle shit. Ooh, this is going to be problematic. Because we have this guy here, and they're probably going for him, or for my ninja. Or for these guys. Actually, these guys are good against Mitsuke's. I can try and take care of one of them right now, which will probably succeed, but... Oh, the monk's probably gonna get rid of him instantly. I can't really put him anywhere else, because I would just lose so much money. But then again, losing him, is that worth it? I don't think so. But I think I'm gonna... Tough it up and hope that I don't lose him. Uh, right. I need you to go and check out what they've got. Actually, if I could use you for killing one of these guys. But then I also put him right next to the Metsu case. Um. No, I need a, I need a, um, a ninja. Where's my other ninja? I have one here. Oh, here he is. Right. 
Okay, you can go out and check this. Ah. Okay. How happy is Ise? Four. That's not very happy. Punishment rate? Campaign? Wow, well, fucking hell, really? Those are two, like, the best ones. Well, not the best ones, but they're really good. I love campaign movement range. The thing is, this army isn't a moving army. Um, because it's not planning on going that way at all. Uh, I think it's going to be in more fights, and the movement range is fine, because we're going to be able to take Awari in one turn. Okay, right, you need to get out of the way. Okay, so Issa is going to be unhappy. What well, we should have... A monk around here somewhere. We have one sitting in Tamba. 16. <sighs> I need the army to sit in Setsu, which would mean... Oh yeah, Setsu is actually going to rebel as well if I don't do anything about it. Where are... Okay, right, I need to know where all my monks are. Alright, there's two of them here. Right, I forgot about that. Six. What levels are you? Four and four. Uh, inspiring castle towns. Right, so I think if I move this guy out, plus one. Ah, oh, shit. He's got the plus one happiness. Oh no, it'll, it'll be fine. Yeah, it'll easily be. It, it actually might even be fine moving both of them out. Well, thirteen. No, not quite. But I can easily move out one of them. So I'll move out this guy. Shit, but if I move him that way, if these guys are going for him... Fuck. Alright, well at least I'll use him for something else. I'll put him in Hida. Which doesn't make that town happy enough yet. Oh, just by one. Uh, anyway, so we have... Yeah, we have two monks sitting... Oh, we have one monk there. We got one monk in Inaba. One monk in Etsu, we knew that. And then we have one monk in Tamba. Right. The... Shit. I can't move him, so let's say we're gonna do this. This is 100% happening. Tamba is happy, but that's just because of the monk, yeah. There's no way I can move him out yet. I don't have to take Awari, but it's a really good defensive position. Land consult, yeah, they do have a castle. But it's an auto result. Actually, no, this guy would probably be in range, wouldn't he? Yeah, he would be. Alright, well, in that case, I'm not gonna do it. But I also can't let him go for Omi. I can't go out and siege it either right now. This place is four. It is a fortress, so six, ten. Actually, yeah, I can move out right away, so that's not an issue. The issue is I can't sub. Well, I can possibly sabotage him with this guy. But then I can't do anything against those guys. But it will also give me a little bit more information. Yeah, all right. I'm gonna try and do that. If it works, I'm gonna take Awari. All right, I'm taking Awari. Nice. That's good as well. Enemy agents are going to be a big deal, though. Okay, so you guys are going to take that. I may have to resolve or exempt from taxes for a turn, but, you know. Money's already an issue. That's not really going to make a whole lot of difference. All right, so we're going to have to be sitting in this town for a little bit because it's going to be very unhappy. Actually, it's not actually that bad. should be very unhappy. I mean, it's minus 14, but it's like it's because it's a castle, it'll be all right. Uh, are we fixing it? Yeah, we are fixing it. I can now sort my squirrels on here. Anyway. Uh, have we moved? Yeah, we moved this army. Yeah, we have. Right, Inaba. 18. Yes, I can go out and take Hoki right now. I'm going to be running into enemies soon, though, and... Fort, this is a fortress. It's a, obviously a lot better to defend than a simple fort. We have a ninja. How about you go ahead and scout out ahead? Ah. How about you scout out ahead further, actually? Okay. Looks like it might be alright. But the way he's standing that way makes me think that it might be another army coming. The thing is, if I once I take Hoki, I'm not going to move any further. So I may as well sit in Naba. Hoki's not going to give me a lot of income. 
The reason I don't want to move any further is because if I move that way, they can attack me from here. If I move this way, they can attack me from there. If I move this way and then move back into Hoki, they can't attack me from um, there anymore, but they can still come from down here. So I would have to move this army to uh, Bizen, which actually is not even that far out of the question. Ooh, they have actually lost this to Christian Rebels. I didn't realize. Fuck, that's really bad, actually. I mean, it's, it's good, but it's bad, because if there's Christian Rebels here, that means all of these provinces are going to be fully Christian. This is still Shinto Buddhism, though, so is that. I can't see what Izumo is, but yeah, there might be a few more Christian provinces there. That's going to be annoying. Not a massive deal, though. The, the, what, the, what the most annoying thing is right now is it looks really good, but it isn't really good right now. Fucking hell, what level is that guy? Level 3. You're level 5, you go take care of him. Oh, that's Omi though, I can't move him out of Omi. The guy from Key is also level 5, alright, you go and do that. Should just try with the other guy first, actually. Alright, good, so that's one guy I got rid of. Doesn't mean I lose a bunch of money this turn now. And our income is very, very, very problematic right now. We're down to minus 3.3k. We need to take care. We need to get rid of an army or take more and more provinces. I can't take anything here because obviously we need to sit in Setsu. Oh no, wait. Setsu is the province where it's going to be fine if I make one unit. So that should be okay. But we can't reach Harima this turn anyway. So we'll do it next turn. Um, yeah, one unit of course costs more money as well. You can you go in here? Nope. That would be useful actually. Get some information. Right. So that was. Kind of a mistake, but it actually works out. Army is still coming from down here. Um, we're sitting defensive mode in the Naba. I'm not going to move any further. We're just going to defend against armies here. With our amazing defending army with zero archers. Um, <clears throat> that's fine. Although I wish there was an option to sally forth, like in uh, Rome 2. This guy really should be doing something rather than sitting here. I guess I'll put him in. I can't. I want to put him in that army, but it's too risky because he's just gonna get picked off. Actually, not well, not by that army, but by anyone really. So I do want to have him in some army. So I'll just shove him in this one. I think. I want him to have his own army, but for now, it's not a thing. I want this army to have a general, but hey, you can't have it all. Anyway, let's have a quick look here. How many provinces have we got now? We have 26, and the Oda have 24. Alright, so we are actually bigger than them now, although I don't feel it. Um, right, do you guys want to trade? No. I I'm pretty sure they're going to declare war on me soon. Oh, hello. I have weapons that Aww. need polishing. Speak quickly, so that I may be about something useful today. I really need some money, mate, so if you just do me a favor and give me just a little bit. I sound like a beggar at this point. See, this is why you get as much money as possible every time, because... If I didn't do that, then I would have been just that one turn closer to bankruptcy. It's funny how at first I was really worried about all the older armies, and I still am a little bit, but now I'm more worried about going bankrupt. Because I've really done... Oh, wow. No, I would never do that. Not because I haven't threatened them enough. Um... But yeah, now I'm worried about going bankrupt, and that's a, a real possibility. And there's not much I can do about it, because I can't get rid of any armies right now. All of them are doing their jobs. This one's defending the west, together with that one. This one is valiantly defending the east with a, a minor army. This one is going to take everything, and then this one obviously is going to start taking shit down here. Once we get to the point where we can take town after town, which is relatively soon, I think it's going to happen next turn, possibly. Well, next turn we're going to take Harima at least. And this army is going to get there soon. Oh, what? You're supposed to be in that army. The fuck? Oh, shit. Here we go. And looks like he's going to fail. There's going to be a lot of agent actions this turn, I think. There's probably going to be one of my Matsukes that dies as well. Alright, he's not doing anything. That's good. So he's going past that Matsuke. He's going to try and go for my Matsuke. He's going to have a lower percentage, but he's probably still going to succeed. And if he doesn't, his friend will. He failed. Alright, that's one. And he's going the other way. Alright, so at least we got one more turn of Kaga, or Matsuke and Kaga being alright. That one unit, I don't know what the hell's wrong with him. Oh, fucking are you kidding me? 
Um, no, nah, there's no way. I don't see me winning this. No, no, I can't win that. What the fuck? Really? I want ship. Why is he not sitting in a port anyway? Oh, because I lost that province and then I took. No, wait, that's a Chico. I always. Oh, no, wait, yeah, because I just lost that province, right. Um. Right, let's get increased in rank. Trade being broken, apprehension attempt, province lost, army crushed, conversion attempt, mounting and rest, mission issued. Alright, that should probably work. That's quite good as well. Okay. What was that? Yeah, that was that mission. Natural cause was no. Which one? In which my ninjas was that? Six? Six. Alright, so it was a weaker one, but still. That's still no good. Okay. Right. So the question is, what are we going to do about that? It's a s small army. But it's still something that I have to deal with. Okay, he actually didn't do much. All oh, right, he went for my monk. I forgot that I put a monk in there. Okay, well, anyway. Um, let's have him just flee this way, I guess. There's really no point for him doing anything. Probably should have gotten rid of him a long time. Well, 59 income is really not going to make a difference. Uh, we have to deal with that. It's just that I don't know how. What do we send this army over there? I think that's the only option we really have. It's gonna take so long to get. Well, actually, it's not too bad. The thing is, if I do that, obviously we're leaving this undefended. But it's all right. We can again go down here, and it's basically the same idea. However, it depends on what he does. I guess if he goes to Chiga, or actually we could send that army back. If he goes to Fukushima, then we could. Uh, he wouldn't get there before I do. Or we'd get there at the same time, it's not a big deal. Our income, though, is such a big deal. Okay, right. Let's have you... Yeah, if you just take a rematch, then those guys will come in as reinforcements and they'll just die. So that's fine. But, let me just check real quick. I want this guy to level up. But, he's not going to level up from that one fight, so... And again, if I just put him, the army over here... It's not going to make too much of a difference. Fuck it. Let's just go. Alright. No, I lost three men. Both my generals. And one general's retainer. Alright, you go in there. So that's what keep them happy. This province is not going to be happy for a while. Four, eight, ten. Eh, not too bad, actually. But it's not going to be happy. Right, you need to know or see where that army went. There it is. I need them to come and attack. Well, I could siege them out. It's currently spring. But I don't know where if they've got anything else coming. We knew there wasn't anything there. Like, it's fine if they have a few units send over, but they can't send over an entire army. I think they'll just attack me either way if I just go for it. Which means I'll be on the attack. Or on the defense. They do have six archers, so that's fine. Yeah, alright. We'll siege them out. They will attack me right away, so that's fine. Uh, this place is actually relatively happy. Six, seven, yeah, that should be fine if I move out then... Oh, we don't have to move him out right now, actually, so that's fine. Uh, we're going to move him back this way to go and check what they've got over there. Right, so over here. I don't think we can attack that and auto-resolve it. Two generals. I could probably assassinate both of them, but... Can I spread the money? Yeah, it's not that much. I think that's uh, worth doing. Oh, they broke trade, you kidding me? What a that's kind of shitty. <sighs> Construction. Right, ninja, 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 ninja. I need to take care of all their agents as well. Have I done this yet? No. Oh, wait, is there actually something that... Uh, apprehending, yeah, I'll take that. Enemies were executed, thank you. Right, let's do that over here as well. 
This guy is still standing outside and again if he does it. Alright, that's good. You go back into key. That'll save me a bit of income. Let's see how much. Maybe a thousand. Twenty two hundred, yeah, that's about a thousand. That's good. Um this is really it's just it's four units. It shouldn't be a problem, but it's it's just such a nuisance because there's nothing I can do about it. Um right, yeah, anyway. I probably could get rid of both here. And then I can take care of it, and then I could even take oh I can't actually can I move out? Eight. <laughs> Not really. I mean, I yeah. Well, I could take out. I can take out the army, and I think that might actually be a good idea either way. So let's go and do that. Let's assassinate this general. All right, and then you have to assassinate the other one. Ah, oh, fuck's sake. Mm, it's not a very strong army, but it's not an auto resolve army either for me. I don't think. I, I, uh, I think I have to, otherwise I might go for Omi, and I just have a bigger problem. So let's try. Oh, they have armor as well. Um, I really don't want to fight this, but I think I have to. Oh, right, of course, yeah, because I'm just going to keep the army alive. I forgot about that. Actually, went into me now. We're probably... Oh, yeah, they're actually... Well, that's just that one unit that's in the way. We could probably take it, but I don't think I will. Ah, I probably should have. Eh, I don't, I don't know. I don't know. If we assassinated the general, it would have been a lot better off either way. Okay. All oh, right, we can make another ninja for 500 bucks. Yeah, why not? Could come in handy, especially since they're great at sabotage right away. That's meh. Yeah, we'll take that. I mean, that's really good, but he's not going to be sitting in army, so it's meh. Right. So we're sieging there, armies. We are right. Yeah, we still have this to do. We need to take care of this guy. Let's move over here. So the thing is, he didn't actually come for me. Which makes me think that I have to go out and attack him, which is alright, actually. This, his army is really bad. How is that not an auto resolve? Oh, maybe it is now because I, I got some men back. Let me see. Yeah, it's more than before anyway. I think I'll do it. I'll go and finish them off. thing is, if, if they were waiting, it meant that maybe there was another army coming, and I would not want to deal with two armies at the same time. I mean, it'd be fine if I if I fought it myself, but this makes it easier, because the, uh, re the replenishment is rel relatively fast. I may have to sit there for two turns or so. And this army, yeah, maybe next turn will take Mino if they haven't replenished too much. And then we'll have to keep these two provinces happy, and then this army is probably going to start... Uh, this, uh, I can't get rid of this army. I want to, and I, I think I have to, but I can't. I, I guess I could merge some units together and just get rid of two of them. Like two katanas, but that will only save me like 500 bucks per turn. Uh, that's It's a lot, but it's not enough. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I need, I, need a, I need the army to stay strong enough as well. Amazing. Anyway, there's still a lot of agents over here, I think, to take care of. We got rid of that one. Right, there's still a monk over there. I guess we'll take our monk. Echu is... not for gonna be happy. I don't need this unit. It's only 59, but there's no need to keep him. They're never gonna be happy, so I'm gonna have to actually do that. 68. Go on, son. Alright, that's kind of shitty. He's already done it something. Uh, we do have still have this monk, though, don't we? And since the army's sitting in there, that's fine. Come on, son. Thank you. That's good. 
Ooh, I completely forgot about that. I nearly had a rebellion on my hands. Minus three, yeah, I'll have to do that for one turn, it's alright. It's alright. That should be happy, yep. This is such a crazy campaign, this is definitely the hardest I've played so far, I think. Alright, so I think we're gonna have another attack on our hands, let me just quickly go through all of everything again. Just to make sure we're not missing anything. If I would I would feel fine right now if Okay, that's alright. He moved into my territory as well, so he's not actually gonna replenish. Please don't get rid of my best ninja. Whew, he failed. Good. There might be more guys coming though, but still. Okay, he's putting up okay the port that doesn't even have any trade, so whatever. Yep, alright, I was expecting that one. Um Oh he actually has two of these as well, so he does have eight archers as opposed to my, of course, zero. So that doesn't matter. It's, it, you know, if anything, it's probably not not bad. Um, he only has f six units of infantry. Does have a lot of cav, but we have our Nainata counter them. I think this army is actually the completely untested army that hasn't fought anything yet because they all have exactly the same amount of experience. Alright, no really good hills from the looks of it. Maybe this one actually. That might be alright. I think that's actually going to be a very tall hill because of this thing. This is going to be extremely high, so this looks like it's not very high, but it is. And probably the same for this one to be honest, but it doesn't have any forest. And I need the forest to cover my arrows, well my men from arrows really. I guess we'll find out. Overall, the campaign is going well. The thing is, though, there, we know they have a lot of really strong armies somewhere, and I'm pretty sure we're coming up to them soon, well, with this army right here. Okay, let us see what we've got. Sorry, this hill is actually not very tall at all. Neither is this one. But it does have cover, and it is, the, is probably where I'm going to set up. Oh, man, if only the, it, it extended to over here, I would have just definitely taken that hill. Um, I could also set up on this. Mm, it's not actually a terrible idea. Just checking out where we can actually set up. So yeah, just over here. And down. And then a little thicker up until there. And then we can set back up here as well. I don't know. I don't think so. I think we're going to take this hill over here. We'll just have to run up to this point so that we have the trees for cover. Uh, ninjas can stay on this side. Um, I think I might actually just make these guys my front line, just because- no, I, I can't. I, well, because of the amount of cavalry, but I think the katanas are fine enough against cavalry that I'd rather just purely protect. Also, I need to make sure this time I don't fuck up my general. I have to run him over to the army and keep an eye on him. Actually, I think I'll actually place a unit over here of katanas- or, um, Naginata Samurai, just for that purpose. And the four of you, what am I going to do with you? I'm going to keep you I'll put another unit over here. And then have these guys over here. These guys over here. They're gonna be used as a flanking unit, so I don't really want to use them from here because I need to. I want them to downhill charge because that's that's where they're most effective. But I also don't want them to be on the front line, and I don't want them to be behind the Naginata because then it needs to be a charge, like right onto the enemy. It can't be a charge like through my own men because then it just won't be as effective. Okay. Okay, they're right there. I am on the defensive though, so they should be coming for me either way. So if they don't. Well, they're not close enough for me to charge them. Their katanas look to, like they're coming after me, but that's fine. 
actually going to set these guys up. I guess we have a first unit here as well. Oh, actually, no, I need to walk up further on this hill. So let's do that. And no duchies. Yeah, this is better. I like that. And then we can still put that unit right there. Okay, general is already here. Good. Okay, so they're moving one bow samurai, one katana cat forward. I could charge into that. The thing, uh, I think I have to, to be honest. But the thing is that that means that after that we'll be fighting down there, which is not where we want to fight. We want to be fighting downhill over here. But I think I have to charge in there, especially since he's moving up three more or two more katana. Cav, if we can take care of all those free units right away. We'll just keep all these units where I'm going to place them. So we'll have five units plus all the Nodachis in reserve. He's moving all of his men over. Uh, general. Move him up because it looks like these guys might be trying to flank around or something. We're all right. Right, we do have to shoot it over here as well. Which actually, we're not going to send him there. Need to watch out. This is not what the Nodachis are intended for, but they can full out murder a katana cav unit with a charge as well. Okay, you need to get in there. You need to get in there. Alright, we are not doing as effective as I thought we would. Yeah, this is not their intended use at all, but there wasn't really any choice there. Okay, right. Start getting these guys in where I want them, which is right into all their bows. We're going to try that for once. Okay, this is really not going well. They haven't lost much yet. I'm glad I kept one unit over here of uh, Naginata Samurai. At least we're breaking or killing most of them. Alright, I'm just going to charge them right on in there. I could charge them in the rear here, but actually I'm going to leave that to my other men. We're all right, mostly. Oh shit, he is losing men actually. Fucking hell. Never mind that tactic. Charge right on in there. Fucking hell. They're murdering my general over here. Okay, you guys are done over there. Get in there. These guys should be wrapping this up rel relatively soon. Come on, shaking. Get out of there. Okay, my ninjas are in there. And they will wreck those units. There we go. They're broken. Okay. You guys, break through there. Alright. That was tough, but the battle meter did say that they would actually win. Well, yeah, that they were uh, more likely to win. I actually completely forgot they had that unit. The Kiyomasa Katana Cav. That's alright. We haven't lost anything in its completion. Uh, you really should just get in there. Not leave them shooting you in the rear. We lost a fair amount of men, but not Lord, too bad. It was definitely painful, though. And we are sieging them, so we're not going to get any of our men back, and they will not get any of our men back either. But I'm just meaning in a purely we're going to have to attack them again after this. So this is the army that we're stuck with on the next attack as well, which is probably going to be an auto result, but still. Yeah, that was definitely a little more painful, but it still worked out. The tactics still hold up. It's just that we weren't able to use our Nodachi effectively enough. You can see that I got very little kills. I wasn't able to charge them for one, uh, because they were behind that one Naginata Samurai unit, which I was afraid of, but I'm glad I left them there, because otherwise they probably would have been even worse off against all those Katana, Cav. Um, and... You guys can actually go after that one. Uh, and yeah, so I wasn't able to charge them. Plus they were stuck the entire fight fi fighting um, Katana Cab. By the time they were finally open to do something else, the fight was already over. 
Uh, let's have you go and kill off these fellas. Hopefully we will kill enough of them that uh, it should be alright. The ninjas did alright though, 157, 142, that's worth killing afterwards as well, but still. Overall, Naginata seemed to have done a fairly good job. Actually, it looks like the Naginata got most of the kills. They were in there most uh, as the front units as well though. You can definitely see their perks as well. I really like them. Just having a few of them. They're good, obviously good against anti-cav, or good against the cav, so anti-cav. But besides that, they're also just extremely heavy units. They've got far ha heavier armor than the katanas, an extra four. So if you were to actually put armor on them, they would just be crazy. Well, I've done that before in other Let's Plays, of course, but still. For those who haven't seen that. Anyway, I think we've killed a fair amount of them. So that's good. We're not going to be able to kill anything else here anymore. These guys, that's just two. How about oh, three, actually, but you're done. All right. Close victory. Meh. <sighs> I never really agree with the, the game's victories. The way it describes them, I mean. Anyway, that is another episode. I think I'm going to record another one right away. Because this is exciting. And fun. We're finally getting into the fun aspect. And, and we're looking good. It's still just the only thing I'm worried about is income. It's just... I don't see any option for me out of this. We lost a thousand as opposed to their two K. Oh, they only have four hundred forty-eight men remaining, so that should be absolutely fine. And yeah, Nayanata, 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 Nayanata. So yeah, they were definitely up there in the Kisha Ninjas, but because that was after the, uh, we've already won and won Katana Summer, I was up there. Not too shabby though. Let's see what else happens. All right, no more Oda stuff anyway. Apprehension attempts, monk increased in rank, port blockaded, and warriors recruited. Alright. Oh, actually, this is good. Instead of going for another point here, I'm actually going to do this so that we can move a little bit faster. And inspiring armies, I guess I may as well. I would normally go for the happiness since that's his plan, but meh. Anyway, um, so I'm going to end it there. Uh, next time we will be taking... Oh, fuck it, let's do that. Since I'm just going to continue right on anyway, so it'll just save everything. Um, next time we will be sitting in Hoki. Uh, probably going to move on from Harima, not entirely sure. I need this guy to go out and see what they've got coming from there. And that will determine whether I'm going to take Miyasaka um, or not. And then I'll also take Bison. Um, and then we'll probably be sitting there for a few turns, getting everything happy. Uh, oh, and this is Christian Rebel, so... Actually, oh wow, all of this... Oh my god, Oda barely have anything at this point over here. That's crazy. Um, oh wow, but they have... Yeah, this is where their six-star general army is, I believe. And that's a one hell of an army. I think we probably need two of our armies to be able to defeat that. Um, over here, though, we're looking really good. Uh, this army moved away, didn't replenish. We did, so we should be able to actually just kill that right off. Um, they did recruit a unit, though, somehow. And we got this army moving over there, so we should be able to take Ichigo back soonish as well. Overall, looking alright. Looking relatively good, I would say, actually. Income, though, in two turns will be bankrupt, so. Not that good. I don't. I, I really don't know what to, what to do about it right now. The only thing I can do is getting rid of an army, but. I can't. I just can't. There's just no way. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and I shall see you next time. Have a good day. Bye bye.